kwa sasa tunaenda moja kwa moja katika majengo ya bunge ambapo mwanahabari wetu Vincent Odori kwa huko na anafuatilia kwa karibu ambapo waziri wa mazingira Keriako Tobiko kwa sasa amefika mbele ya kamati ya bunge kuhusiana na swala zima la mazingira anahojiwa kuhusiana na awamu ya pili ya kufurushwa kwa watu katika msitu wa Mau tuweze kusikiza picha hizo anaojiri katika majengo ya bunge what they say as a criminal so that or letters of allotment so that then we know who it is that sold or purported to sell because that is a legal issue this land to them. as we speak now and since even while we are dealing with phase one, there has been reluctance on their part to come forward. And because we, these deliberations are open in the media, uh, to the media, it's, uh, again I make an appeal. And I would urge also the leaders to make an appeal to all these to come forth, go to the county commissioner and provide copies of the sale agreements, provide copies of the letters of allotment, so that then we know the individuals or entities that purported to sell these uh, parcels to them because these are the individuals who would not only have committed crimes for obtaining by false pretenses but putting to sell land that does not belong to them but also these are the individuals surely who should be able, who should be compelled to refund the purchasers, if they may be called so, the money they received or the consideration they paid. These are the individuals also who in the alternative, if they have land to their names, should be able to resettle persons from whom they receive money. But we're having this challenge in, um, in them coming forward. I, and I make these uh, appeal and chairman uh, members also using your own leverages and your own position help us so that they can come forward now chairman the coming to the let me deal with this issue first before I go into of the because there has been a lot of debate, discussion about what exactly is the legal status of the Mao, uh, Masai Mao. Is it a trust land? Others call it. Is it a settlement scheme? Oh, what exactly is the legal status of this? Because that question also will inform the determination about the validity or otherwise of the ensuing titles or title documents. Documents of purported ownership.
chairman members the Masai Mao uh, forest was originally under the old constitution a trust land forest a trust land forest that vested in the county council then of Narok to be managed for the benefit of the residents of that uh, jurisdiction. That was the original status, trust land forest under uh, the old constitution specifically at sections 114 to 120 of the old constitution as well as the trust land act now how do you allocate How do you issue titles in respect of trust land under the old constitutional and legal framework? Two ways. One, either by setting it apart. for a particular purpose by the county council or by the president setting apart and that would require gazettement and once you gazette you set it apart it would cease being a trust land that's one way the other way which would be relevant for our purposes here is if you desire to issue titles to individuals or groups 